Michigan junior midfielder and all Big Ten tournament team pick from a year ago, Anna Schuler joins us now. And Anna, it's just the third year of Michigan women's lacrosse. What does it mean to you to be a part of this program from the very start? Oh, it's, I mean, it's an incredible honor. And I think um, coming in as a freshman and our, our whole freshman class really have learned to appreciate it, what it, it really means to start a program, especially at such an incredible institution that Michigan is. So it's been an awesome ride and an awesome journey. I think we're really excited to be upperclassmen and really see where we can go this year. You've led the team in goals in each of the first two years of the program, but what's one area of your game that you've really worked on to improve over the course of your career? I think just overall um, stick work and field awareness. Um, it's something that I've wanted to prove on since I've started playing lacrosse, and it's something that anyone can always improve on. So definitely just field awareness, stick work, and just the little mechanics that come with the game of lacrosse. Last season, you did not get a conference win in the first year of Big Ten lacrosse, but what can you do overall as a team that can help you get to that goal this year? Well, definitely uh, just learn from that. I think there's really, as the past two years, that's been a huge uh, component that we've thought about is learning from the mistakes and whatnot. And I think we have confidence in ourselves that we can compete within the Big Ten program. I mean, the conference is unbelievable, but we're definitely really excited to learn from what we went through last year and the experiences we had last year and hopefully be able to take that to wins uh, in the conference this season. You've led your team in draw controls one each of the last two years as well. What do you work on throughout the entire season that helps you get possession for your team? It's really just um, communicating with who's you. I mean, if I'm on the draw or Kim does the draw and she's doing it really well this year. So I think just communicating with her and exploding off the line is really all you can do. Um, hustling to the ball, it's all, the draw is all about effort. So whoever gets there first is going to get it. And I think as a team, we, should, we need to work on that and just um, all being like it's not just one person around the ball. And so hopefully we can improve on that because I think that's a component of the game that we really can improve on for this season. There are several new, year, new rules this year for women's lacrosse. How do you feel like they're going to impact the game, and what did you see this fall when they brought in those new rules? Well, um, I think that it'll, it'll speed the game up, and I think something that we need to learn to play with more is the self-start. And um, I think just being more aware and just I think we can really use it to our advantage as many other teams can. I think the game of lacrosse, women's game of lacrosse, will be very exciting and uh, really fun to watch this year. What are some of the things you've learned from playing the sport of lacrosse that have helped you in other areas of your life? Well, the sport of lacrosse and I think just being a student athlete in general is, as everyone says, time management and um, responsibility. And I think being a college student and having the responsibilities of practice, you know, meetings, film and all of that is really just what made you grow up as a person. And I think we're able to apply that in our schoolwork and hopefully in careers in the future. It's definitely something that we can you know, have that experience and it's going to be a really great component for us as we get older. As a Chicago native, how excited are you for your team's trip to Evanston in April and then the opportunity to play in the Chicago area for the Big Ten tournament as well? Oh, very excited. I think it's, I mean, it's always fun going back to play uh, in Chicago. We had the fall ball games. Actually, we played Northwestern. We played at my high school, Loyal Academy. And I think going there in April, obviously the number one is to get a win, but obviously it's going to be great to see um, family and friends hopefully come out to watch some of the games. And obviously for the Big Ten uh, tournament, it's going to be a really great experience as well. Michigan junior midfielder Anna Schuler, we appreciate you taking the time and best of luck this year. Oh, thank you very much.